Greetings folks, it's time to try these sweet little carbon bird motors on a couple of planes. So I have the faster revving 1175 motor, that is going to go on my little de Havilland Hummingbird scratch built model from Depron and XPS Foam. Currently I'm using a Sunny Sky uh, 2212 980kV motor. This is about the same power and cost actually, interesting, no this, this motor is actually a lot cheaper than the Sunny Sky, should be about the same output, so that one's going to go on the Hummingbird, and the slower revving 888 motor is going to replace the Sunny Sky, same Sunny Sky motor on my Mini Talon, on this sort of lightweight build of the Mini Talon. Hopefully they're going to work well, let's mount them up and see how we go. Both of these motors can handle 3S or 4S, the Sunny Sky motors are only rated for 2S and 3S, so more speed, more power. Time to test out these gorgeous little carbon bird motors. Uh, this is the Faster revving 1175 kV. I think that'll work fine on 3S, uh, but I know it'll work well on 4S. And we've got the 888 kV on uh, the Mini Talon. This has the 9x5 uh, HQ thin electric prop supplied by Multiwee Copter as the most efficient prop for this motor. And this is the 11x5, I think it is, uh, HQ thin electric as well, uh, which is also the best prop for this motor, according to. Quinn from multi Copter. Let's uh, try them out, see how they go. As usual, we've got lots of wind. So first up, we've got the Hummingbird on 3S. A bit tail heavy, Oop. Come down. Need to move that battery forward, but that's got enough power for scale flying for this plane. That's awesome. Smooth sounding motor and prop. I love these props. I haven't balanced that at all. Could probably even get it smoother and quieter. I reckon that'll be better. Let's go. Big gust of wind. Oh, lovely. Look at that. Now we're flying nicely. Whoa, it doesn't like the turbulence going downwind. Half throttle. Needs more to fight up against the wind. 4S will make it race around, but that's, that's fine now. We're in a turbulent spot here around behind the trees, but um, look at that, that's beautiful. Listen to how quiet that, quiet that motor is, that's beautiful. Let's fly with a bit more speed. It's a bit better in this wind. But I do like flying slow. Gorgeous. All right, I'm busty to try 4S. This is just a 3S 2200. Perfect for flying around scale on a calm day. This, this would be awesome. All right, I've taken the 3S 2200 in and put a 4S 2200 in. Let's see what happens now. <laughs> yeah, got all the power I can want now. That's, that's just nice range that's half throttle flying awesome it's doing a bit better with it a bit of extra weight in the nose too more weight overall with that heavier battery this is so cool slow it down for a slow pass 
Beautiful. Did you hear that motor or not? That's freaking awesome. Sweet. Right now for the Mini Talon, I'm going to try it with a, a 2200 4S. I have been using a 3000 4S up in the nose. Well, actually, batted back a bit from the nose, but uh, I reckon it's going to work okay with the 2200 right up in the nose. Triple eight kV motor, pushing that all the way forward. Where's the CG? CG's right on the servo cable, so that should be right. No problems with that at all. So this is now a very lightweight build. This is only just over a kilogram, 1.1050 grams or something like that. So this is just going to be a floater. So we oh, got a nice turn of speed. That's against a pretty good crosswind. Got my rates turned down a fair bit. But well, this is cool. Turbulence. Plenty of grunt to cut through that. Oh, strong wind there. You can Probably a 15 knot gust, but I'm just flying around on half throttle. I've got plenty in reserve. Very cool. So there we have the little carbon bird motors. They are easily the best quality motors I've ever used. Smooth and efficient, especially matched with the thin electric HQ props of the right size. Awesome looking, awesome performing little motors. Direct replacement for the Sunny Sky uh, 2212 I found. They can handle forests, no problems at all. Great motors from multiweecopter.com. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more Carbon Bird and Multiweecopter gear coming soon. See you later.